Okay, let's get right back to our final segment with David already. Uh, okay, oil. We've got to talk about the oil blowout in the Gulf. It's going to be with us for quite some time, and it could turn into be a planetary-wide disaster if this gouge into the Earth's inner arterial system continues to spew at the volume and the pressure it is. It's huge. David, what do you think about the whole thing? Uh, yeah, well, I, um, I, I wrote an article about it, actually, this, this, this week, uh, which uh, always, of course, focuses the mind on looking at all these different aspects to it as you pull it right. together. And it is, uh, it is uh, utterly uh, catastrophic in, in environmental terms. But, you know, when, when you look at um, the background to it, uh, the run-up to it, uh, uh, I don't buy incompetence. <laughs> I, I, I buy, at the core, um, uh, cold calculation. And um, the uh, the selling of shares and the fact that Halle Burton was involved. I mean, red flags go oh, up. Halle red flag Burton, they ought right. to call it. Yep. And uh, and 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 then you've got the consequences. And uh, you, then you look at um, the way uh, again, very clearly, when you see the the people involved speaking on the ground. BP couldn't give a damn about cleaning it up or stopping it. It's going through the motions. I mean, you, you, you see these um, interviews on the Internet with some of the people that have been involved in the cleanup, and they're saying, you know, well, maybe, maybe two hours a day. And, 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 again, a common theme is, oh, when, when someone comes in who's kind of important or there's cameras or it's the president, then mm -hmm. everyone's alerted and everyone's on the beaches and, and cleaning up and everyone's running around. And as soon as the helicopter leaves, it all stops. Right. I mean, why would uh, you not uh, do whatever you could to react to this? The reason is they want they want the catastrophe, they want the chaos, for, for a number of reasons. I'll, I'll, there's one one level. Yes, of course, they're going to try to use this to push the global warming tax agenda, uh, because uh, you know the climate gate and all the other stuff has really put a right. hole in. in, in they in, capitalize in, in, on every tragedy always. Yeah, exactly. You know, I mean, the the, the climate gate thing is really uh, you know been a big problem for the credibility uh -huh. of this global warming lie uh, yeah. so they'll use this but it's bigger than that um they want to create as much chaos as possible and and when you create chaos and and you create um uh, fear you are fundamentally affecting the vibrational state of the population i mean okay uh, exp expand your, your your mind to connect with with higher levels of consciousness when 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 oil's pouring onto 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 the beach and creating an environmental catastrophe when you you've lost your whole way of life and uh, and what have you and then with the potential consequences of the acid rain there's already oil rain falling um in 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 the gulf area oh, yeah. and, and and all these other uh possibilities of, of, of massive environmental uh, damage, fundamental da damage, uh, a long, long way inland. You're, you're looking at a, a situation of, of, of potential uh, catastrophe for far more people than those that just live a, a, along the, the Gulf. And then you've got the Gulf Stream out into Europe and, and, and all the rest of it. And so it's about, uh, it's just one part of creating maximum chaos, including uh, uh, wars and, and, and economic chaos, anything that can create mayhem within the human energy field out right. of fear and right. worry and what's right. going on and all the rest of it. And they're feeding uh, and off of this. A lot more of these things, uh, yeah, a lot yeah. more of these uh, different, in different areas of our lives.